Um, so what made you get into the music industry? Well, um, I used to be in boxing. Um, I got, uh, you know, I mean, cousins and brothers that were in boxing. Um, and they were all good. My brother was a, an Olympian. Uh, my cousin was a champion. And um, <clears throat> I used to go to boxing, and I would come home, and my other brother and his homie would be in the room rapping. So I started um, picking up, like, I guess that from him and I started trying to write raps so um, the first track I actually did I was about 11 years old and it's called I'm a G you can download it for free on uh, SoundCloud I put out like a 50 track mixtape with what's your SoundCloud so the fans can know just uh, the real Mr. Homicide anything that they want to look me up Instagram Twitter Facebook YouTube the real Mr. Homicide and I'll just pop right up and what made you stop going the boxing route or do you still or do you still box or no? No, nah, um, just a hobby now. Or? Yeah, I was, I was really good at boxing, man. Like I was, I retired undefeated. A lot of my friends are, um, they're all undefeated. They're all professional boxers now, like uh, Victor Pasias, Frankie Gomez, uh, Sanisha Strada, and they're all doing their thing. But it's just, um, I didn't have enough time, homie. Like to myself, like it was Monday um, to Saturday. Uh, get home from school, straight to the boxing gym, come home around 10 o'clock at night. So it was just, um, I guess, kind of overwhelming. So like when they say it's hard work, dedication, it really is. But uh, I guess, um, you know, I mean, I left that alone. And then now I'm just uh, doing my music thing. And I like it better because I have a lot more time on my hands to do, spend time with family and just do a lot of things I like to do.